you know, people often ask us, um, you know, what, what data can you get from the device that you put inside people's heads, right. which is a great question. Um, what's the key lesson or two you've learned, and what's a story of success that, you know, that keeps you moving forward? Yeah, I think that, um, yeah, we do have a complex ecosystem, and I think where we've struggled in the past is being able to prioritise the highest value things to focus on. Um, so you can focus on everything and only improve things slightly. Um, and what we've done over recent times is to be able to actually measure the moments in the customer journey that would make a real difference and then put value on those, still work in progress, um, and then be able to focus on that area to drive more value um, across the ecosystem. So certainly that's been something we've tried to focus on. Um, whereas before we had kind of product teams working on everything and so prioritizing based on value in the customer journey and experience has been something that we've been really focused on. Are there multiple customer journeys? Yes. So, yeah. yeah. And, and so different journeys for recipients. But we also have professionals, which we talked about, surgeons, audiologists. We have providers in the hospitals um, and distributors. Uh, and then we have payers, which are the sure. insurers. Yeah. So we've actually got four different customers with different journeys to manage and, and work through their experience. And they all contribute to the outcomes. Right. So all equally important. If somebody can't get reimbursement right. or if they can't get into surgery, right. then you know the, the good stuff doesn't happen. Right. Um, yeah. Wow, interesting. So lessons learned, uh, what else would, would you share yes. with us? So I think prioritization. Yeah. Um, I think, as you mentioned earlier, not waiting until you've got all data to be able to move on a problem. Um, so what we've done with those Tiger teams is put the data professionals into those business Tiger teams so that they can surface data as quickly as possible. Um, I think building relationships in the ecosystem for trust. Um, so trust is a big thing. Um, do hospitals trust us to look after that data? Um, how do we make sure we create trust um, and we build relationships with partners in the ecosystem? Um, yeah, I think they're the main lessons yeah, that, that we've learned. Yeah, and I think to make decisions quickly. Right. Um, so, again, working for a, a company that's highly quality focused um, means that you know everything is perfected, um, which can be great in some aspects, but others you need to move fast. Um, so for customer journey, why can't we trial things? Why can't we experiment? Why can't we do different things? Um, you know, on the implant, absolutely quality is the highest priority, but how can we move faster on some of the other areas? I, I've done a number of uh, sessions within Cochlear, and, and the thing that I always, I walk away two inches taller because of the mission. The, 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 the buy-in to the mission is amazing. Right, um, but that also makes change not so easy too, yeah, right? Yeah. So you've been in role 18 months. Um, what changes have you made in the, start with the IT organization uh, to drive value faster? Yeah, so I think you're right. Um, with a company that's been successful, um, it's quite difficult to create that, um, that burning platform that drives change. Um, we've got aspirations of, of, of being, you know, having twice as many recipients in the next 10 years um, so that growth is now driving us to make change and move faster. Um, the changes that we've made is putting in a data and AI center of excellence and actually really investing in that capability has been a big step forward. Um, using partners more. So again, in Cochlear, we, uh, we, we know everything better than anyone else, um, which is, is probably not exactly true. Um, so being able to use partners to bring their thinking to us um, we spent quite a lot of time with some great, I, they're not startups because they're actually worth quite a lot of money now in the US, data companies that are doing great things with health data and that can bring great insights to us. So partnering with large and small organizations to bring more external thinking in. Um, we have improvements to make. Okay. So our partners are very generous with their thoughts and then we tell them they're wrong. Um, so um, there's improvements to make on how we partner. <laughs> Um, we're getting better. Um, but I think it's knowing what you're good at and then bringing partners for what they're good at.